Hi there, I'm Matt from the Underground Cookery School and today I'm going to do a video cookery lesson for you. So today I'm going to show you how to pickle beetroot, but before we pickle we've got to prepare the pickling vinegar and spice and I'm going to show you how to do that. Well to create the, the pickling sauce or liquid, the supermarkets have now just made this job dead easy. Um, you can actually buy jars of pickling vinegar and um, you can also get um, little um, jars of pickling spice. Um, and the reality is all we need to do is take the vinegar, which I've got here, and just pour that, the whole lot, into a pan. And I'm going to use about a third of a jar, maybe a bit more, of the pickling spices. Throw that into the pan. Now, what we need to do, I'm going to put the lid on because I want to bring the vinegar up to the boil. And as soon as that comes up to the boil, we're then going to pass everything through the um, sieve here into the jug. Um, what we'll then do is use these preserving jars to create our pickle. Well, as you can see, that's now come up to the boil. And it's going to take it off the heat. And what I'm going to do, you can really see the steam coming out of it now, is just pass the vinegar um, through a fine chinois, or in this case, just a sieve, fine sieve. There we go. Just capture all those spices. There we go. And there you have the perfect spicing liquor. So we've got our spice liquor here, or our um, uh, pickling uh, liquor. Um, and what I did earlier on, I'm just going to bring this up to the camera so you can see, is I cooked off some beetroot, which I diced up. And this is what we're going to Pickle. Now the first law of pickling is um, use an airtight jar um, and make sure that it's been sterilised. In order to sterilise it, you need to um, boil it in water or possibly even um, in a dishwasher. It needs to get up to 85 degrees to kill off any bacteria. Um, I'm just going to run into here, grab myself a spoon um, and I'm now going just to put the beetroot into the jar. Now once you've put all the vegetables into the jar, you can put whatever you like in here. Um, sometimes um, I quite like to put a little bit of extra pickling spice, so I'm going to do that. And now that the jar is um, packed full of the beetroot, and I've added obviously a little bit more of the um, spices, I'm just going to put the liquor into the jar. What you should make sure is that the jar is completely cooled down. Um, you want that to cool down before you put any liquid in, otherwise it will crack. Um, what you can then do is, I, I would rather just let that cool off before closing it up like that. Um, and then you can leave it. I'm going to open it up now. Uh, but as soon as that's cooled down, I'm going to close it up and then you can leave it for as long as you like. And that is how to pickle beetroot.